Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today let's play around in New York City. I'm hoping here for a few rounds that are not in Manhattan. I'd like to really uh, sort of develop my knowledge of the surrounding boroughs and so on and so forth. So the Manhattan ones will will probably skip through quite quickly, but the rest is is what I'm looking for. So maybe we'll we'll play a couple of games. I'm giving myself a five limit time uh, five minute limit here just to avoid, you know, any um uh, sort of really wasting too much time on things. So this is Manhattan. Let's just get in there. Uh, this is, I think, it's not Union Square, it's the next one up. Um, here we're actually by the, um, I think it's this square here, no? We can see that we're on, I thought the, the Empire State was on 5th to the right hand side of it. We're looking north, um, so maybe I'm a block off. Madison Square, that's right. In fact, yes, if we look behind us, we should see the Flatiron Building. I'm pretty confident in this. Let's uh, scroll around. This map should minimize. Yeah, look, there we go. So there's the Flatiron. So we're at Madison. That's fantastic. Uh, we're just a bit further north, aren't we, I suppose? I think we're probably up here, actually, in the middle, because um, we're looking across Fifth Avenue. So let's go for the guess. Brilliant, just a few meters away. Next round, hoping for a round outside of Manhattan. This looks a bit more like it. Um, let's see what we can see here now. I'll do a cursory scan around. This is the sort of thing I'm hoping for. Ranger's sign. And the reason I'm hoping for it is just because, as I said, it's it's a little more interesting. It's, it's um, a little tougher. So we've got Hope Street here. Hope Street and what does that say? Hope Street and Marcy. I'm just going to write those down. Marcy Avenue. And it looks like we can join some kind of freeway here or something, so let's get on that and see what the next sign is, because that might give us an indication of the borough that we're in, for example. So what do we have here? Wythe and Kent. This is west on 278. 278 Wythe, Kent. That's the next exit. So let's get in here and see if we can spot the 278. There's the 278. In fact, it goes all the way from from New Jersey here, doesn't it, through the through the city, up into Queens. Uh, let's see. Does it carry on? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Right. So it could be anywhere. Um, we're currently going south, aren't we? So south and west. Um, 278, 278, 278. So let's go from here. I think that this looks like it might be the, the start of it, at least. Yes, about there. And we were, I think we were to the south of it, weren't we? But I'm just looking either side now. So we've got Bruckner. And I'm, I'm looking for Marcy, aren't I? Garrison, Bruckner, progressing through the Bronx, just hoping to do this in an orderly fashion, really. Bruckner still is what we've got there. So now we're coming out of the Bronx. I don't think we're in Randall's Park. Um, so what do we have here? Astoria, Astoria Boulevard, Astoria Boulevard. Following the 278 down here, Brooklyn Queens Expressway. What is this street here? Is this... No, that's just... To be clear, I'm looking at the streets either side of the yellow of the yellow freeway, because that's the ones that we, we came up to. 278, 278, so what is this one called? Laurel Hill Boulevard? No, nope, we don't need that. So we're not on Laurel Hill. We weren't in this cemetery here, 278 now, continuing down. This is still Laurel Hill and 43rd. We're not there either. We weren't on Cherry Street. Mika, is that the name of this one? We're looking for Marcy Avenue, is what it was. It sounds like it could be in Queens or Brooklyn, maybe. Marcy. 
Broadway. Oh no, we don't want to take the Williamsburg Bridge, do we? 278, we're still going on down here. Marcy, found it. That's Marcy Avenue. So is this Marcy Avenue here? Yes it is. And we are looking for Hope Street, aren't we? Well, we've got 4th, we've got 3rd, South 1st, Hope Street. Boom, found it. So we've started there. That did take four minutes. Goodness, the time really does does go, doesn't it? So where were we? We've, we're looking... We're just off of Marcy now on, on Hope Street, aren't we? So we're about... We're about there. Are we level with this building's alleyway, for example? Yes, we are. There's an alleyway between these two buildings. That's to the southwesterly uh, side of us. And that's the alleyway here between these two buildings that we can see. So we've absolutely nailed it. I'm just going to scan open this out a bit and kind of recap the logic. So we t found the 278. We know where Marcy is now. And uh, I was just following it down, so we've walked our way down actually all the way through through the Bronx and through Queens, and we're in, in Brooklyn here in Williamsburg. So that's the bigger picture. Let's go for the guess. Done. Just a meter away. Look at that. Next round. Okay, this also looks like somewhere outside of Manhattan, so that's good. We've got the La Lantiga Deli. Let's get to the intersection here, where we can see these street signs a little clearer. So that's 30th Drive. Okay, I don't recognize Drive being, you know, it's usually avenues or streets, isn't it? So, um, I'd just like to get, can we see the intersection? Not on that one, can we? What do we... Ah, oh yes, we could probably get it Get it from over here. 14th Street. Okay, so 30th Drive and 14th Street. Now, where do we have drives? I'm not exactly sure, you know. Um, so let's just see if there's any other information we can get from from our surroundings. 14th Street Laundry. We've got this pizza place here, does it say? Air conditioning, laundry, dry cleaning. Let's see, can we see anything in the distance? No, we cannot. Beauty salon. Hmm. Not sure about this one at the moment. It does look like there's a main road up here. No, no, it doesn't. You know, we need to find somewhere now that gives away the borough. Or we start looking on the map, that's the other one. So Palmer Tile. We could just enumerate the boroughs. I mean, presumably there's only one 14th Street in each borough. So what we've got here, so here's maybe some more clues as well. So we've got 28th and Astoria. Okay, well we know where Astoria is, so let's start with that. That helps. Um, Astoria is in Queens, kind of like West Queens by Long Island City, I think. So let's get in here. That's Long Island City. This is Astoria. And we can see 30th Avenue straight away. So maybe there's a four, maybe there's a 28th that we can we can get. Um, 28th Avenue here. Can we see an Astoria Astoria Boulevard is the is the name, isn't it? Hmm, 42nd, 43rd, 31st, not obvious is it, Twen oh, we've still, it still carries on though, 28th, that's good, Main, hmm, I don't see an Astoria Avenue, do you, that could be a killer, we've only got a minute left, two minutes left. Uh, so what else are we looking for? We were looking for 30th Drive and 14th Street. So we've got the streets running over here. There's 9th, 14th. Do we see? But I don't see any drives here. They're still talking about, still talking about avenues. Oh no, there is a 30th Drive. Yes, 30th Drive and 14th Street. 
There we go. Lantiga Grocery. Fantastic. How come we didn't see? We've come up 14th Street. We've hit 30th or 28th, haven't we? Maybe it's here, Main Avenue. Main Avenue might be what we're looking at now. But anyway, I think we found it. So let's go back, see where we started. So we started back just on the intersection of the Lantiga Deli, and we're looking east, which means we are to the west of it, aren't we? We're just a few buildings back, actually. Let me go just get, click off the map and see where we line up here. We're just behind. There's a gap in between these buildings, which I think should be on, should be on here. So we're about there. Let's go for the guess. Brilliant. Next round. Okay, this is far more of a sort of a freeway we're on. We're actually by a huge cemetery. There's a huge kind of um, bit of a strange chain of cemeteries down here through where it says Forest Park and so on. And also around here, a lot of these green spaces are actually cemeteries in New York. There you go, the Cavalry Cemetery, the Mount Olive um, you know, it's a bit, it's a bit, it kind of looks like there's a bit of green in New York, but there, I mean, unless you fancy going into the cemeteries for your, for your walk in the park, um, it's not all what it looks like it should be. So, where are we? We're going east-west, and we've got exits here for Cypress, Cypress Hill Street, Cypress Avenue. Did we not just see a Cypress? Cypress Hills, there we go. So, you know, I thought it might be on this. Um, oh, where's that gone? It's just, just okay. We've got Cypress Hills Cemetery, so let's. We've got exit two and three coming up for Cypress Avenue and Vermont Place. So there's Cypress Hills Street, exit three, and that is what we are looking at here. Uh, we are going, we are facing west here. We're facing west, which means we're to the east. So the next exit, which is in further distance, is Vermont Place, which is up here. So we're so we're currently somewhere in here. Now this exit three is the one that's coming up Cypress Hill Street, and we can see that just there, can't we? So let's just head back a bit and see what else we can do. We're just a bit to the to the east of that. So that's the Cypress Hill Street exit. I think we're about here because behind us we'll see this corner. I just caught it out the corner of my eye earlier. Yes, there it is. Look, we're on a really sharp corner. So I think that that's pretty much locked us down as to where we where we are. Let's just um, see if we can't get it exactly right. We're on that side of the road. And the corner, has it just sort of started? I would say just about. So we just where the straight bit turns into a corner. So let's go for the guess. Zero meters. Look at that. A zero meter guess. Fantastic. Play next round. Okay, so this is one we're back in New York. In fact, we're very near Bryant Park. This is a very famous recognizable building. So let's get there. I said back in New York. I obviously, I mean back in, back in Manhattan. Um, Bryant Park is down here. No, it's not. It's up here. Um, we're sort of somewhere in this this region. Okay, let's let's go and take a look. Um, we just need to get to an intersection, really. That's all. We're heading west, and we've come across. What have we come across? Uh, 56th and 8th and 8th. So, oh, we're a bit further up than I thought. So, 50. Fifty-sixth and eighth. So we've come onto this intersection here. We headed west, didn't we? So we've started facing that way. That's strange. I thought I could have sworn that building was in Bryant Park, you know. And in fact south of it. So that's that's very strange. So we're looking here, we're looking west. In fact we've got an address right there, don't we? 238 West 56th Street. 
so we're on 56th. We can see the toothpick building behind us, that's to the east. Hang on, that's to the east. So we're on the other side of the road, aren't we? We're on the other side of the avenue. We're now facing west and going west. And then this is 8th. Don't want to mess this up just by being a bit cocky. Getting my east and west confused. Yes, we've gone west on to 8th. So going west onto 8th would, would put us more about here. Let's just zoom in and see if we can see any business names or anything. Back to the start. This is the longest round in Manhattan anyway. We've got Fuji Sushi Bengrez and another restaurant. Where is... Do we see any of those? Not quite. What about this building opposite us here? Is there a McDonald's? That should be on here. Yes, there is. McDonald's is there. Perhaps we're a bit further up, are we? Hmm. Ah, oh, we've got the Szechuan Gourmet. You can see that. That's about here, so I'll put us about, about there. Let's go for the guess. Nine meters away. Fantastic. Could have made a mistake there. Look, we had two in Manhattan, so why don't we play another round in just the hope that um, we'll get a few more, let's say, in Queens or Staten Island or somewhere somewhere else. So play the same map again. I'm going to just give myself maybe a 4 minute 40 second limit, something that gives us enough time to find things. This could also be Manhattan. It looks a little more sparse than sort of the really built up areas. Let's go to this intersection and see what we're looking at. We're by a park, which is pretty rare. Um, Chambers Street, I think I see Chambers Street down there, and that's that's down in the southern tip of Manhattan. So we've got Chambers and Greenwich. Okay, right, and we can see the the new uh, Freedom Tower in the in the distance there. So let's let's get in. This is another Manhattan one, but I will say the southern tip of Manhattan is a little more interesting because you know it doesn't follow this grid pattern, and um, you know it's just a bit more sort of. Um, uh, you know, there's a bit more sort of going on to guess and figure out. So we've got Chamber Street here. Uh, Chamber Street, and what was the other one? It wasn't Church, was it? That's um, Chambers and Greenwich. That's right, Chambers and Greenwich. Okay, so where's where's Greenwich? We've started by a park, so we're possibly up here. Yes, that's right. Okay, let's go back to the beginning. Return to start. And we've got the park here to our north, don't we? Yeah. And there's this kind of funny walkway up here. And what are we? We're not really by a building actually at all. Actually, there's a if anything, there's a there's a bit of a playground in there. So yes, that's that's this area here. We can see this independent school must have this area uh, sort of sectioned off here. There's probably, if you could turn on the map view, you'd see a basketball court or something. And then this is that way up there that we can see. This is a pedestrianized area. We're looking at Washington Market Park. And just want to triangulate myself a fraction better with relation to this building. I think we're just kind of lining up, to be honest, with the edge of that, aren't we? So maybe we're about, you know, about here. Go for the guess. Fantastic. Okay, just a few meters away. Next round. Oh, unfortunately, this is another one in Manhattan. So <laughs> I wish you could uncheck Manhattan. Maybe I'll create that as a map myself. Um, so, you know, uh, famous buildings here and so on, famous architecture. Let's get to this intersection. We're on. 53rd and I think that probably says Lexington but I can't quite make it out Madison excellent let's get in there glad I looked so Madison Avenue is on the eastern side here it's one of these um, we've got parks so first second 
third and we want to be in 53rd. 53rd is down here somewhere. Third park. Which one is this? Is this Madison? Yes it is. Madison, 56, 55, 53, and I think we started here. Back to the beginning. And we are looking east, aren't we? Which means we are west of Madison. So yes, we started somewhere about here. In fact, you can see that funny triangular bottom shape of the building, can't you? Let's um, try and line ourselves up with this building here. See what's going on. It's got this kind of step out, doesn't it? So let's let's see if we can see that on the map. Yes, we can. That lines up about there. So we'll put us there. Guess. Go for the guess. Four meters. Next round. This is interesting. NYC's only revolving rooftop restaurant. All right. Well, look, unfortunately this is turning out to be a Manhattan-only round at the moment, which is the opposite of, of what I was hoping for. But nonetheless, I, I, I hope hope you're enjoying it. Um, we're in Midtown here again. Um, we're by the Booth Theatre. Just try and remember this stuff now for when I do move. Um, and the Marriott Hotel. So let's go. We're heading east. And this is pretty much kind of Times Square type area, really. Um, in fact, yes, we're on it. We're on it already. Um, 45th and George Abbott Way. So let's get in there. This is We're actually in Times Square, really. That's what everybody else would, would know it as. If you've not been, this is Times Square. It's not really an area that most New Yorkers would call home, to be honest. Uh, what do we say? 45th. So... Let's just get off this map again. 45th, we've come down 45th, didn't we? Which way did we go again? Um, we went in a westerly direction, so we were to the east. So 45th. So this should be the hotel, no? Um, this looks like the big, big building that we're, we're alongside. Um, I'm looking for... Junior's Bar? Junior's Restaurant? Can we see that? Yes, Junior's, right there. Yeah, okay, good. That helps. And, uh, well, there's this gap, isn't there, between these two buildings and and the Booth Theatre. So we're, we know that we're spot on, actually. There's the Booth Theatre. We can see this gap, and we're sort of more aligned up, actually, with the edge of that Booth Theatre building, aren't we? So let's go there. Excellent. Seven metres away. Next round. Do I recognize this? Have we had this one before? You know, I think we have. That is crazy if we've been dealt the same one again. This is 40. I think we have. In fact, the reason I remember this is because I had an absolute nightmare and just moved my pin away before I clicked on it. Um, those of you who have watched it will remember that I get, made the guess and then as I went to sort of move my mouse around, I was just talking away to myself and accidentally clicked off it. I think what we're looking at here as we look northwest is Morningside Park and we established that we're on something like 118th Street, we're about here um, before and then I got the guess wrong by accidentally clicking off it. So let's just get up to this this one here. I think we should be able to do this pretty quickly. I just recognize it. I think I do. Morningside and 118th. Look at that. There we go. I do have some memory left. So Morningside and 118th Street, it's right here. Quite hard to kind of line up with the front of the building, but I'm not going to spend forever doing it. We'll just figure it out. It's there. Okay, excellent. Next round. Five out of five, and unfortunately... Is this another Manhattan one? Yes, it is. Well, would you look at that? Unfortunately, folks, we're 0 for 5 in ex-Manhattan uh, uh, geo-guesser locations on this round. So, um, nonetheless, I think I'll post it anyway, just because uh, because we've we've filmed it. So Barrow Street. Um, this might not be Manhattan, to be honest. So we're just looking across a bit. I don't recognise Barrow Street as a name. 
Um, we might be looking across the water yet, so hold hold your breath. Um, no, struggling here. I think if we get to this road, we'll be able to find a bit more information, because this looks like the edge, possibly the edge of Manhattan. Yes, it is. Okay, so look, this is the the west side highway. We're looking west there over to New Jersey and Long Island City. Um, we can see all the way down. We're by Pier 40. We can see all the way down this road. So let's, what's, can we find out what this road name actually is? This is the one that we're on. No, it just says one way. Okay. So let me give you an idea of what we're looking at. Um, we're back on Manhattan. Um, this is the West Side Highway, this street here that says like 11th Avenue. We've got here piers, Pier 46, Pier 45, and so on and so forth. We should be able to find uh, the street that we started on, although I can't remember it off the top of my name. Was it Barrow Street, Washington Street? Not sure. But basically we've made our way out onto West Street here, and we're looking south at... Um, at the uh, the new Freedom Tower, which is down here, the One World Trade Center, and west at uh, Long Island City, which is over the over the Hudson River here. Um, so let's go back to the start and looking up north here. This should help. We should be able to find out where we are from this intersection. So that big main road is to our left. And what is this? This Just need to move a bit further to see that street name. Christopher Street. Okay, so we've got Christopher Street there. And that's the one we've come across. I'm trying to find the street we were on. So Christopher Street and Washington Street. Okay, so very good. Right, we've established that we're up here somewhere. So it shouldn't take too long. This is Christopher Street, and this is Washington Street. Okay, so we started maybe somewhere in here. Let's go back to the start. Was it Barrow Street? I, uh, my memory's uh, sort of fading away a bit, but I think then that would make this street Barrow Street. We should be able to confirm. I should have written that down earlier. Yes, that's right. So we started in Barrow Street. So it's a question of how far between Barrow Street and Christopher Street were we? Well, we've, start, we've sort of started in the line of this building and there's just this funny step in that building isn't there so there that's the step I'm looking for there and on the other side there's really not much to go by not not so much at all come on map minimize please yeah not so much to go by look I think we can go by this building here the fact that there's a bit of a step out there so um so let's let's just go for the guess Yes. Excellent. Another 5,000 points. View summary. Well, look at that. I'm obviously not very good at wishing because I was hoping for five options outside of Manhattan and we got five options inside. So 25,000 points pretty much guaranteed because uh, with that time limit you can really afford to take your time. We had 25,000 in the other game as well which was a bit more exciting because there were I think three if I remember correctly places outside of, of Manhattan so they take a little more investigating. Uh, nonetheless look I hope you've enjoyed this game. I'll keep playing and uh, try to surface some uh, some uh, X Manhattan guesses more, and uh, if I can't, I might look into trying to create my own uh, my own map, which I've never done before. So we'll see how that goes. Anyway, thank you very much for playing with me today, and I'll see you in the next video.